why people love being flabbergasted. You'll see it in supermarkets all the time. There's like a long line, right? Like only one cashier is open. Everyone's standing there patiently. There'll always be one white person who pops out like... What are they... Why don't they open the other... Are you serious? Why don't they... Are you... The only thing white people love more than being flabbergasted is finding another white person to flabbergast with. Have you seen that? Yo, whenever that happens, magic. It is absolute magic. A white person will be flabbergasting. They'll look, they'll make eye contact with another white person and then they'll flabbergast together. It's like they Voltron their flabbergasting into a super flabbergast. You see them look over and just be like, oh, are you seeing that? <laughs> so, fast forward many decades, we're in Edinburgh, Scotland, going out with my friends. We're choosing a spot. I choose Indian, authentic Indian. We get to the place and it's legit. Like, it is legit. We walk in and there's Indian music playing. There are Indian people eating, Indian cooks in the back, Indian waiters, Indian guards on the wall. I'm like, this is it. I'm home. <laughs> we walked in, we sat down. And as soon as we sat, one of my friends, Steve, launches for the menu. And I was like, Steve, Steve, it's cool, man. I'll just order for everyone at the table. And he's like, oh, oh, that's, that's fine, Trevor. I'll, I'll just, I'll order for myself, thank you. I was like, no, no, it's, uh, it's not about that, Steve. I'll, I just prefer to order for all of us, yeah? Right? You good? He's like, uh, I don't know why that's necessary. I, I think I'll just order for myself. Is that okay? I was like, uh, it's not. No, it's not okay, Steve. It's not okay, right? Because uh, you're probably going to say some shit that's going to embarrass me in front of my Indian people, right? And so I just need you to back off for a moment. He's like, I'm sorry. What would I say that could embarrass you in front of Indian people? I was like, I don't know, Steve, and I don't want it to happen. Just let me handle this, okay? He's like, let you handle this. Trevor, I'll have you know that I've eaten curry for many, many years. I'm like, Steve, this is not the time. Just let's not argue, okay? Let's not argue. It's not the time to argue. He's like, what do you, what do you mean? What, what, why would I embarrass you? Why? I was like, there's no, you don't need to know why. Let's just, let's just not do it. He's like, no, why? Why? Because I'm white. I was like, you brought it up, not me, all right? <laughs> I wasn't going to bring up race, but you did, Steve. And now that you brought it up, let's talk about it. Every time I take my white friends to an ethnic restaurant, they always say some shit that embarrasses me. Every single time. Every time. Either they don't know how to pronounce the food or they'll say some random shit. They'll be like, can I get that one, the Papa Doms? What do you call these ones? You know, they'll be like, can I get this one but not spicy? Kill yourself!